can you just catch yourself a little bit on what has been a bit of a, a roller coaster week but maybe from the point when you knew that Ireland versus France wasn't going ahead yeah it was a disappointing outcome but um, these are the times we're in and so we just have to accept um, the circumstances that, that came about and um, from our point of view we were already down to come in and, and camp and prepare um, for the test match with the wider squad anyway so um, you know like everything at the moment we, we're adapting to the circumstances and so we've gone through with camp this weekend and it's given us a chance to have a hit out internally and while it's not a test match um, it's as good as for us to make sure the players are able to back up a performance from the week before so um, it's about being match hardened and we've taken that, that opportunity and run with it. Where to next for you guys now? You know, that France game is still on the horizon in some capacity. We want to look ahead to World Cup qualifiers as well, obviously. So what does November look like for this squad? Yeah, look, at the moment, it's still very much still week to week, but um, we have a plan in place for November to make sure that uh, we're in training camps again, where uh, we're preparing for those qualifiers as if they're still going ahead in December. So it's still a busy schedule for us. Um, we're going to have a, a week off after this camp just to refresh the body and mind, and then we'll be back in the, the following week for another three-day camp. So um, it's about, I suppose, honing in on some of the detail that we missed from last week's uh, test match, but also what we've done in training you know we've got a really good body of work done now and uh, we've just got to make sure that we keep training hard and, and making sure that when those test matches come along we're, we're prepared and ready for them. From a coaching perspective even from a, a selection perspective you, you are moving into perhaps a maybe a, a period of reflection now in some sense. Yep, absolutely. That's, that's spot on. We are. We're having to reflect and review um, what's gone on the last six weeks for us and that's probably happen, happening a little bit sooner than you know we would have liked. Obviously, if we'd had a test match this week, it would have given us another week. But um, we're now going to review our squad and um, you know it's now about moving forward into those qualifiers and uh, the players we take there. So, you know, again, the squad that we've had has been highly competitive at the moment and that's what we want. It, it drives performance in our environment and so we're just going to look at it now and make some decisions uh, based on moving forward.